DEI Summit was an awesome event. Um, the speakers were phenomenal. Dr. Shannon Mason just brought so many things to the forefront on allyship and some things that I think are very evident and some other things that I think, for me, raised my consciousness. Well, the summit was uh, very, very, uh, what I would call inspirational to start with. Uh, it created an environment that allowed uh, the members who attended to learn something new about allyship. I like the engagement that everyone had in it, and it seemed like everybody was in tune and involved. I really enjoy moments like these because I'm, I'm very big on open dialogue, and the first step to anything is to start the conversation. It was valuable to have different, diverse people talking about their shared experiences, and you could really empathize where they're coming from and what struggles they have. It was a very good meeting, and I'm looking forward to moving things forward. You know, our industry is very largely male, and as a female in that industry, it is really good to see that as a chapter, we are bringing issues and education um, to the forefront for uh, diversity, equity, inclusion, and belonging. I look forward and hope that we can uh, pass this around to other chapters because it's an exceptional opportunity to have uh, professionals come in and talk about the challenges that they encounter and ways to make things better for everyone who works in the industry. I want to congratulate Christine for the award. It's a real honor to, to get that award. It's very well earned this year by Christine. It has been a tremendous pleasure and honor to work with Nika over the last two years. Really excited about the hard work you all are doing around developing inclusive leadership habits. Uh, around developing allyship behaviors. And so it's been a privilege to partner with you all in this journey of inclusion. I wish you the best in your future efforts and hope that we'll be able to continue our partnership.